In French, the word Renaissance means to be reborn. It was a time of wonderful accomplishments in architecture, literature, art, music, science and exploration. The city-state of Venice was a trading superpower whose ships were protected by a powerful navy. Venice controlled a large empire in the eastern Mediterranean, trading throughout the Middle East and was described as the New Rome. Florence is generally described as the cradle of the Renaissance. It developed from a small Roman settlement on the river Arno into a walled urban environment. Florence had no port, but its wealth came first from the cloth trade, fine wool making and later silk. Renaissance Italy pioneered radical changes in treatment of the poor, with the ruling elite and the church providing networks of charity including orphanages, workhouses and shelters. Most recipients of charity were women. Social welfare support focused on aspects of women's poverty, such as illegitimate births, hunger, unemployment and domestic violence. The most significant war occurred in Lombardy between 1423 and 1454. It was a series of four campaigns between the Republic of Venice and the Duchy of Milan and their respective allies for control of northern Italy. During this time, the political structure of Italy was transformed with five major political players emerging. One of these, the Papal States, was under the control of the popes, who came from the nobility and could scarcely be considered churchmen. They were ruthless politicians whose central goal was the expansion of their political power. Petrarch, a writer of passionate and beautiful sonnets, was fascinated by the ideas of ancient thinkers. He also found forgotten copies of the works of the Roman writer Cicero and Roman historian Livy. This led to a major revelation. People believed that you could find answers to the issues of the present in books of the past. Galileo relocated to the University of Padua in 1592 and, while there, heard of a Dutch invention we now call a telescope. He built his own and hurried to Venice to show it to members of the Senate and the Doge, Leonardo Donato. Because a telescope could be used on both naval and merchant ships, the Venetians saw its value and gave him a well-paid job. The Italian city-states were often at war with each other. Between 1492 and 1499, Leonardo worked for the Duke of Milan, Ludovico Sforza, designing weapons of warfare. During this time, he was commissioned to paint Virgin of the Rocks and The Last Supper. The Renaissance spread quickly, beginning in the 15th century from its birthplace in the Italian city-states to the rest of Europe. With the growth of the Renaissance, these ideas diversified and changed, adapting to local culture 